All right, Throttle Thursday, Nissan is known for quality, reliability, but what may surprise you, they are currently producing one of the most inexpensive cars in the entire world. Fox 5 automotive expert Nick Miles is here with, uh, we have two small cars today that have a whole lot to offer. We were just talking about how this is a whole new generation of affordable cars, inexpensive, but with a lot to offer. Good little features, customization. Oh, good morning, by the way. <laughs> good morning, I, yeah. I, I got all involved and all excited about it. Um, the Ascot is back. I, is. I miss mine. Okay, so tell me about this because uh, the Versa this is has the Versa been around note. for a couple of years yeah. now. It's taken off because it's a good car and the price is just right. Tell me more. So first of all, you should know about this car. And this is the new Nissan Versa Note uh, exclusive right here. It is the number one selling uh, entry level car in America. And it number has one. been number one since 2008. So you know it's a good car because people right. are buying them. And this time around with the Versa, they've packed it with stuff, leading uh, legroom in the back, mm -hmm. 38 inches. At some point you should get in and try it because it's very, very roomy in the back. Right. It has lots of exciting features on the outside and they've completely restyled it for 2014. And that's the key, man. You put a, the, a, what I've noticed in the smaller cars nowadays that they've put the, the detail in the styling of it so they look cool. Right. You know? They do. And so this car, I mean, the redesign looks like a sleek automobile going down the road. It does. They've done a lot of fun things with it. You see there's a line down the both sides of it. Right. Now, that line is called the squash line. Mm -hmm. That is the line, if you ever play squash, similar to racquetball, that's the line the ball would take when it hits the wall and comes off. That's yeah, how they clever. designed it. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's just clever and it's intuitive and, and very functional. Let's talk about engine and talk about MPG because I'm pretty sure that that's pretty good gas mileage. It does. 40 miles a gallon makes it uh, outstanding. Wow. Uh, 109 horsepower. It's uh, a little uh, a little engine in this car, 1.6 liters, right. but uh, it's absolutely efficient. And they have the CVT transmission in mm -hmm. there, which is kind of, uh, it's like an automatic, but it uses several different cones in there to, to change gears. Uh, those things make it extremely fuel efficient. They've lightened it up. They've right. changed a lot of stuff on the inside of the car. But the usable space in it, it means that you can haul around five people. It's not a car where everyone's the best. Oh, like, no, you, there's usable space inside. It's spacious. And, yeah. and it has pretty cool technology because I'm looking in at some of it now. So you can get all that stuff in, in your car for an affordable. What is this price range or something like that? Well, this car starts in its very base model under $14,000. And you cannot, and you'd be a, you have a hard time topping it out above eighteen thousand right. dollars, and that is way below the competition. Yeah. And for that, you're getting a brand new car with technology redesigned. That's pretty cool. It's and then There's you know what? You're There's right about the legroom here because this car. And you look, look you, in the look in the back seats look especially. At that. Yeah, the especially. back seats. So it's and not you you're not cramped that at all. Room? That's a ton of room in the back seats. Uh, I want to mention the technology in here. Yeah. They have this Google routing system on the inside. Oh, wow, cool. And what it does is it will tell you how to get to your destination the most economical way, using the less gas, which I love. I love that. OK, let's talk about the Juke. The Juke Nismo right behind us here. How does the price of this thing line up with uh, the competition? Well, first of all, there isn't very much that competes with it, because True. this is Nismo means uh, Nissan Motorsports. So it's kind of a race car, family car version of things. Uh, you, you talk about things that people may cross shop with this, like a Honda CRV. Right. There's no comparison. We're still really at $22,000, this car starting price. And I think the key to this is the aggressive design because you're hard pressed to find any car that looks like this. It's right. so unique in the, the, the headlights on the top. It's, where did the design for this come from for the Juke? Well, you, you, the Nissan are very, very aggressive yeah. in their designs and they're trying to do stuff that people want, make things very different. I mean, they, when they add the Nismo package in, you've got those black 18 inch wheels, yep. you've got these stripes down the side even like red mirrors i mean love that. it makes the car stand out it makes you I feel good the idea of the nismo is you can go into your dealer and basically have it kitted out like you would if you'd gone to a parts shop yeah it comes out of the dealership ready to go ready they to figured out people like that customers like that so right. now they're doing it themselves the rims are nice uh, look at the interior while we talk about the the pricing and the the miles per gallon because I noticed like the red stitching, it's like those little details that make right. it kind of cool. So right. how much does this thing cost? The, uh, this thing is around $22,900 um, starting price in it. You're looking at uh, around 32 miles a gallon, which is which is fairly right. reasonable yeah. in this car. But the, the lot of extras you get in this car, the great sound system, the bolstered seats, mm -hmm. all those type of things, as you come stand in it, thin, you've got all those things. And this car is actually the race sort of mom, mom right. and dad's race car version. What's the engine in this again? Uh, the engine on the inside of this is 97 horsepower. It's actually uh, a, a turbocharged engine. This is a turbocharged, yeah. right? Can we open this now? We open this thing. Because I was going to say, this is kind of, it's, 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 it's not necessarily a, a hatchback or SUV type of 
but it's, no, it's but roomy. It, it, a lot of people cross shot them with the SUV and, and Nissan's yeah. really clever and I can show you here in the Versa Raul, they're very clever at uh, making back space here. Hidden compartments for your laptops and stuff. Love it. And oh, the, yeah, the, yeah, the yeah. fact is that this actually floor, they've made a, just a cute little design in this floor so it goes flat. So, so if clever. you want to get every, extra stuff in there. Nick Miles, thank you sir, as always. The Versa in the Juke Throttle Thursday. Can we get into one of these? Yeah, turn you want to you you turn this thing turn, on? Turn it on. See how see. light it can get. Make know. sure we have the key in here. Yeah, go ahead and turn it on and rev it up. Throttle Thursday with my man Nick Miles. Here we go. Back inside we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. We felt that, huh?